Owners of a Staten Island hotel are calling it a cowardly heist. A woman who definitely wasn't Dorothy allegedly walked off with a piece of Wizard of Oz memorabilia. CBS 2 Scott Rappaport has the story. Slippery suspect. Shock. Shock <laughs> and Total disappointment. Shock. Though she tried to give authorities the slip, police think they caught her ruby red handed. That the woman pictured here removed a pair of replica Wizard of Oz ruby red slippers from a lobby display case at this Hilton Garden Inn hotel on Staten Island earlier this month and was off to see the wizard. And, uh, she, she stole it. Oh, she stole them. Richard and Lois Nicotra are the hotel owners. They say the slippers, which they paid $2,500 for and are featured in a hotel video. This is, uh, bought these shoes from the Wizard of Oz. Were on display at the hotel, wait for it, to remind guests that while there is no place like home, the hotel tries its best. We will try to make it as homey as possible. The Nicotras say the suspect obviously made herself at home here, but must not have noticed the 50 surveillance cameras scattered throughout the hotel which they say catch her slipper snatching with the help of two other men who lifted the glass case they were in. The two guys tipped this glass back. She took the shoes, put them in her pocketbook, and went into that elevator. We see her getting off at the sixth floor uh, with the shoes on. They say she later bolted the hotel in a cab. All of this, of course, raises that all-important, unexplainable, perplexing question. Why did she do it? Whatever the reason, police say it's a case of grand larceny and are now asking for the public's help in snagging the alleged slipper swiper, who after seeing herself on this video, will have to realize she's not in Kansas anymore. On Staten Island, Scott Rappaport, CBS 2 News. Well, the Nicotras say that they just want the slippers back. The suspect should just put them in a bag and then bring them to the front desk. No questions asked. All right.